Hello everyone, today we'll be looking at linear graphs. To know beforehand, this type of question usually comes up in a non-calculator paper. This means that substitution is very important as both positive and negative values will be substituted into the equation of the line. So the first half of the example question is complete the table of values for y equals 3x minus 1. So here's your table of values and you substitute in the x values from the table into the formula to find the value of y. So 3 times minus 3 minus 1 is equal to minus 10. 3 times minus 2 minus 1 is equal to minus 7. 3 times minus 1 minus 1 is equal to 4. 3 times 0 minus 1 is equal to minus 1. 3 times 1 minus 1 is equal to 2. 3 times 2 minus 1 is equal to 5. And 3 times 3 minus 1 is equal to 8. And the second half is to draw the graph of y equals 3x minus 1 for the values of x from minus 3 to 3. So here's your graph and you draw on the points onto the graph then you join the points with a straight line. To note for the exam question, in some questions the grid to work out the y values is not given in the question therefore you are expected to create your own table of values by drawing the graph. This allows the marker to know how you calculated the points that were plotted on the graph. So here's the equation of the line x minus y equals to 4. So on the grid, draw the graph for x values from minus 1 to 5. So you draw your own grid. So 4 minus minus 1 is equal to 5. 4 minus 0 is equal to 4. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. 4 minus 2 is equal to 2. 4 minus 3 is equal to 1. 4 minus 4 is equal to 0. And 4 minus 5 is equal to minus 1. Then you have your graph. Then you draw on the points. And then you connect it with a straight line. I hope you found this video useful, please click on the subscribe and bell buttons for more content from this channel and please feel free to share. Thank you for watching.